so I've been asked to give a toolbox tour and I just wanted to show you guys it's a very small one 26 inches but it's a nice husky and the top of the box here I have uh, my level um, I have um, measuring tape flashlight you always need that box cutters um, some more box cutters mask got my mirrors there and there I got my uh, magnet right there for picking up things safety glasses uh, other knife and uh, some scissors uh, different kinds of scissors that uh, that I need I use those actually quite often and um, then uh, top drawer I have um, some of my wrenches um, I use mainly metric wrenches and so my standard ones are uh, in another box but uh, this is a, a nice set um, metrics and these are also metric but uh, these are the ratcheting ones so uh, that's uh, that's pretty cool and uh, as you as you know those those are really nice to use so uh, set of metric wrenches on the top drawer and then second drawer is uh, my socket drawer and um, this is where um, I've also got uh, my metric set um, this is a uh, half inch uh, three-eighths and qu uh, quarter inch um, uh, of course there I have my uh, ratcheting wrenches um, uh, also a quarter inch three-eighths and, and half inch um, drives and um, this is just uh, a nice drawer you know it's got the numbers uh, just easy to see what I want and these are the ones that I use most of the time so I really uh, like using this drawer uh, socket so handy and then uh, the third drawer this is um, the one of course with uh, all the screwdrivers and um, uh, these are basically just um, uh, three kinds I got the Phillips ones there I got the flatheads over here and then over here I've got the Roberts uh, square ones and um, that takes care of that uh, next one over here I have um, the um, uh, Allen wrenches and um, I use this quite often especially when I work on bikes I work on uh, bicycles uh, uh, quite a lot so uh, these are very useful for that and um, uh, once it's laid out like this it's very easy to see when one is missing and when you put your tools back together again you you know where they go and uh, they just go back in place again which is pretty cool um, then uh, moving on to the uh, middle box right there uh, top drawer um, these are all my pliers and um, I have one or two extras in another box but these are the main ones I use and um, I find them pretty useful uh, each plier has a job to do so go in there and over here this is a bit of a miscellaneous drawer but um, here what I have is I have my, my large wrenches. This is my biggest one I got as a 24 mil. As well as a nice big shifter. Um, and then um, I got some I got some punches and and things. This is very this is the smallest one I have. This is a little snap on. I've got snap on tools too. There it is. Um, and then you know just different odds and ends picks and things um, I got some some pry bars uh, two or three different sizes um, a file or two at the back uh, wire brush you always need those so uh, odds and ends different things that you need at different times uh, in your and the bottom one here is the one that has my bicycle tools so uh, most of this stuff um, 
in here is uh, it, these are all uh, bike specific and um, um, so yeah if you if you work on bikes then uh, it's good to have um, some bike tools and you need some things that are really bike specific um, as well as another set of Allen keys um, both standard and, and metric um, getting those um, always nice to have a pedal spanner nice uh, solid 15 and uh, some cone wrenches so so yeah this this drawer over here is just all uh, bike stuff it's got all my different um, bike specific tools in here and um, that takes us to the bottom we come to the bottom box and the top drawer over here is uh, some car specific tools and um, this is uh, my half inch drive torque wrench uh, it's in there these are some extensions uh, quarter inch three eighths half inch all of them are in there I've got one or two extra ratchets over here and uh, another torque wrench this is uh, for a quarter inch drive and it's very helpful very handy especially when you work on bikes uh, to do stuff for that um, here's a brake tool and oops and then of course uh, uh, a pressure gauge uh, to check the pressure of your uh, uh, your pistons um, and then uh, another 3 8 drive a ratchet uh, a tin snips um, and let me see what else I got here oh yes I got this for um, this is just for uh, oil filters uh, and um, and this one is specific um, to the uh, Volkswagen Jetta I have uh, this is a for that uh, specific oil filter um, this is nice to uh, take off uh, pipes or if you think about um, uh, where you need to, to clamp something right there and you put your wrench in there and you can either loosen it or fasten it uh, from there um, uh, nice to check uh, your brake wear and see how much uh, wear you have left um, fuel gauge uh, just specific you know things for uh, for working on your car that you need and um, we find helpful from time to time then coming to this drawer I have um, my hammers uh, I have a dead blow hammer there as you can see um, then I have a rubber mallet uh, claw hammer and um, another small hammer uh, ballpoint and um, over here I've got different bits torx bits um, and so forth and uh, some small screwdrivers so uh, that's for for this drawer now as we come to the bottom part of the cabinet um, we see some power tools um, this is a nice drill and driver set uh, I like Milwaukee so uh, that's pretty cool and then here I've got some uh, different sets this one is um, uh, for spark plugs this one right here is uh, this is a puller set Uh, this is a impact wrench very nice especially when, when to rotate your tires so you know take your wheels off very helpful and uh, this is a, a tap and die set uh, 
haven't had to use that very often and over here I've got a set for uh, for brakes this is a pretty new set I haven't used this yet and uh, but I will be pretty soon and then I've got all kinds of you know uh, little clips uh, for inside the car uh, when you get to this is a uh, this is a vacuum uh, vacuum pump right there uh, very handy when you need to test your uh, your cooling system or something like that um, and uh, this is just a set of o-rings as well and then right on the side here I've got a, a saw that I keep there. I don't have much don't have much space so I just hook it in there so guys that's it that's the uh, that's the toolbox and um, it has most of my stuff um, but uh, uh, as you can see um, it's not that big but uh, it's got everything that you that you really need and really want and um, I'll um, I'll show you the the new toolbox sometime I'm going to uh, be upgrading from this one because I got more tools and so I'm going to um, uh, put uh, take most of this over and um, pop this on the, the other toolbox that I just just restored it's an old one um, that I that I restored and uh, so uh, the tools will be migrating from from the small box to that uh, that that bigger one okay all the best uh, keep wrenching <laughs>